Greater Swiss Mountain Dog The Greater Swiss Mountain Dog, also known as the GSMD, or Swissy, is a breed of large-sized dogs, one of the four varieties that make up the Swiss Mountain Dog group. The oldest and largest of these four, like the others, it is believed to have developed as a result of natural interbreeding between native Swiss dogs and larger dogs brought to this region by foreign tribes. For hundreds of years, these dogs have easily performed many functions like guarding cattle and homes, herding domestic animals, and drawing carts, and developed in isolation in the mountainous terrain. Because of their shared heritage and some common physical traits, until the late 1800s, all Swiss mountain dogs were considered part of one breed. In the early 1900s, with the effort of Professor Albert Heim, consistent differences were noted and separate breeds were identified. The slow growth in popularity was further affected by the World Wars, and it was well into the 20th century before the breed first came to the US. Time for some rough trivia. What was the name of the large Mastiff-type dog that accompanied the Roman legions and is believed to have contributed to the early development of the Swissy? A. Molliser B. Pyrenees or C. Romaine What do you think? Give it your best guess in the comments below before we get to the answer. Hang on tight and we'll get back to this rough trivia question toward the end of the video. The adult male Greater Swiss has a height between 25.5 and 28.5 inches, while the female stands between 23.5 and 27 inches. The male's weight range is typically between 105 and 140 pounds, while the female has weight between 85 and 110 pounds. It is a large, powerful, well-muscled and heavy-boned dog, which is also agile enough to remain active in the tough mountainous regions of Switzerland. The skull is broad and flat, the muzzle is large, blunt and straight. Eyes are almond-shaped and the ears are medium-sized, set high, triangular in shape and gently rounded at the tip, hanging close to the head. The top coat is dense, about one and a quarter to two inches in length, ranging from short and straight to longer and wavier. The undercoat is thick and generally present all over the body. The breed standard calls for a white, black and rust coat color. Grooming The Greater Swiss sheds moderately throughout the year, with major shedding once or twice a year. So a weekly brushing regimen, with a higher frequency in shedding season, is recommended. An occasional bath is advised. Brushing of teeth, cleaning of ears, and trimming of nails has to be regular. Temperament The Greater Swiss Mountain Dog is a calm, confident, and sociable animal that likes being surrounded by its human family. It is gentle with children and accepting of other dogs. Its alertness and boldness coupled with its size make it a very good watchdog. Its multi-purpose heritage means that it would thank you if you keep it busy with some work to do. Training while an intelligent animal and easily trainable, the Greater Swiss can be stubborn and requires patience. These large dogs also take time to develop physically and mentally and require patience when being house trained. As with all large dogs, basic obedience and socialization training is a must. It needs a good walk or a vigorous play session every day to keep it happy. It also enjoys pulling objects, and a game involving pulling carts carrying children can be devised. Health. Life expectancy for the Greater Swiss is 10 to 12 years. While a healthier breed than most large dogs, there are some concerns commonly noted. These include urinary incontinence, which is more common in spayed females, dystichiasis, entropion, epilepsy, bloat, hip dysplasia, and congenital heart disorder. An issue called lick fit is rather common in the breed, which makes the dog lick and swallow anything it comes across. Bold and strong, the Greater Swiss Mountain Dog is a versatile and dependable animal. Family-oriented and fun-loving, it will be equally happy being with you on a hectic trek or a lazy evening watching TV. Find out if the Greater Swiss Mountain Dog would be a good addition to your home. Now you can visit brooklynscorner.com to take our quiz and find out which dog would be the best match for you. Let's get back to the answer to our rough trivia question. The large, solidly built dogs that are believed to have come to modern-day Switzerland along with Roman legions and contributed to the development of the Swissy by interbreeding with local varieties of dogs are called mollusers. That does it for the Greater Swiss Mountain Dog. If you enjoyed this Dog Facts 101 video, be sure to subscribe and paw that thumbs up button. Then go ahead and check out some of our other videos or fun activities on our website. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.